This week, we're covering one run session, one upper interval session, and one hybrid session. Let's get into it. Session one is track intervals. We start with a three and a half kilometer warm up, really easy, and then go into eight by 800 meters above target race pace with 60 seconds rest. Then do a three and a half kilometer cool down. That was interval session, eight by 800 meters. I was doing it just above my five, 5K pace. That was good, that was a good session, good benchmark. 10 weeks to high rocks, so let's see what we can do in another five weeks. Session two, upper intervals. We're doing five by 200 meters on the ski erg at max effort, straight into 10 pull-ups, then rest. Then we do five times 200 meter row straight into 10 bent over rows, then rest. And at the end of the session, I did 100 press ups because I'm doing the bare 100 challenge. I find this session surprisingly tough though. The rest period between the supersets really gets you breathing heavily, gets your arms pumping. Remember to keep that effort close to maximum on the ski erg and the row. Session three, runner strength plus high rock style session. We're doing five by 10 good mornings, five by 10 calf raises, five by 10 squats, three by 10 pull ups superset with dips, and then four rounds of 400 meter run and 15 lunges, and then four rounds of 400 meter run and 15 burpees, and then four rounds of 400 meter run and 15 wall balls. Damn, that was tough, that one. It's much harder than I expected. So started the session with some strength and conditioning, keep me running strong, and then into the high rock style workout. This was definitely a lung and leg buster. So that's how I'm training for high rocks. I did session one and session two on Tuesday morning and Tuesday afternoon, respectively, and session three on Thursday with tired legs. Getting really excited for high rocks now. Let me know how your training's going in the comments. And if you're gonna be at High Rocks London, drop a like, drop a comment. Hope to see you there. Peace.